But on the other side, things are also brewing. And ABC's Cecilia Vega is at the debate hall with a look at how Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton are tangling offstage with just three days until voting begins in New Hampshire. Hillary Clinton rallying her troops. Bernie Sanders firing up his base. Bernie, Bernie. This morning, the latest poll showing a Sanders surge. Once presumed to be a shoe in for the nomination, Clinton now ahead by just two points. I spoke with the former Secretary of State in that field office in Nashua. How are you? How are you? Clinton says she's confident despite those polls. Numbers go up, numbers go down. We have a strategy, we're sticking with it, we feel good about it. The heated rivalry center stage in their debate this week. I think it's time to end the very artful smear that you and your campaign oh, have been carrying on. out. Let's talk about so, issues. And Clinton still not holding back. You seemed like you walked out there ready for a fight. I'm tired of the innuendo, the insinuation, the smear from a campaign that says it's running a positive campaign. Sanders slamming her ties to Wall Street. Madam Secretary, it is not one street. In my view, the business model of Wall Street is fraud. But Clinton is still not saying whether she will release transcripts from paid speeches to groups like Goldman Sachs. Why not just put them out there and put this line of attack to bed once and for all? You know what? We will look into it. I said that. But let's get to what's really going on here. It is a smear. Nobody buys me. Nobody's ever influenced a vote. I don't have to prove that. For Good Morning America, Cecilia Vega, ABC News, Nashua, New Hampshire. ABC's Cecilia Vega on the campaign trail. Cecilia, thank you. We are going to move on now to another major story this morning. That deadly crane collapse.